everyone I hope you have been well and welcome back to my youtube channel and for this video I am so excited to show all of y'all what I have been working on for the last couple of months I've been on youtube a lot trying to get inspiration on like what my next project should be and after watching so many youtube video flip throughs um like let plan with me um I actually got inspired to do a my life journal and a couple of months ago, I went to Walmart and I bought this nice, pretty, hardcover bullet journal that I wanted to start using. And after finishing, like, my 2020 scrapbook bullet journal, I decided to start on my new project. And this is the product. Um, I put so many stickers on it. And this video is actually the process video of me doing it. I have not finished it. I just designed, like, maybe four, like, I like four to ten pages just because I don't want to like design too far ahead in the year because I don't want to limit myself to anything. So I really do hope that y'all enjoy this video and let's get started. All right, everybody. So as I mentioned in this video, I'm going to be setting up my life journal and I'm just going to go ahead and start off by choosing a bunch of different stickers that resonate with my personality and what type of person I am. So I have gone ahead and chosen stickers from every different color of all the different stickers I bought. And now I'm just going to go ahead and start putting them wherever I think they fit well in my notebook. So this page is going to actually be my cover for like my whole notebook and I had a circle in the beginning just because I wanted to do it on the actual paper but the paper is so thin and I don't want like any markers to bleed through so I'm just putting a white paper on top of it. And for this page I'm just going to go ahead and just decorate it just for it to say like my life journal make it look pretty and you know so my page could pop. So I do want this page to have a picture of me and I just went ahead and looked for the prettiest selfie I have and I am using my Canon Ivy a portable printer to just print out that picture. Something that I really like about the Canon Ivy portable printer is that the pictures are not just pictures they're actually also stickers so that is such a good thing for me. As I mentioned earlier, I am going to start putting paper before I begin any layout. I just don't want any pens or markers to bleed through. And this page um, is actually going to be my resolutions page. And I don't really know what I'm going to do yet. So let's just see how this goes. This layout is called the Sharpie Creative Marker S No, and I really like it because the lines come out really, really straight. And I think it's one of like my most favorite markers right now, other than like the Crayola Super Tips. I also just quickly wanted to mention that for the 2021, I'm using the Sharpie pens, and they are so perfect, they don't bleed through at all. So after my resolutions page, I wanted to have a cute page with like one of my favorite quotes and I wanted glitter to be in like this cute calligraphy, like this really pretty font, but it actually took me like over an hour to try to get that pretty font. But after like 
like tries and tries and tries of it not coming out the way I wanted it to I just decided to go with like a bold lettering just because that was easy for me to do and now I'm just coloring it in with jelly roll pens So this is how the page turned out and I'm not done with it, I'm still going to add glitter washi tape at the end. So for these next two pages, I actually wasn't sure what I wanted to do. So I was, I just started putting paper down on my notebook and it wasn't until like the paper was on my notebook that I'm like, okay, like I'm going to do my favorite monthly memory spread and I just decided to add cute washi tape to just give it that extra oomph, like that extra pop to make it look pretty. And right there, I'm going to put favorite monthly memories um, using stickers from a sticker pad I have. So for the months, I wasn't sure if I wanted to write them or use stickers, but then I remembered that I actually have stamps with the month name on it. And I'm just using that and I couldn't find my black ink so I just decided to use red. I created in my life journal I'm so excited to continue making more for y'all and posting them on my craft page on Instagram um, and I just really hope that I actually go through and fulfill like all the templates and layouts that I have been making so far because I know that for 2020 I created bullet journals and I created scrapbook layouts and I never touched them because I didn't want to mess up how pretty they were but I think it's okay I think I'm finally learning to accept that like you know you're I'm creating these journals so I should feel like I I should I should not be scared to write on these journals and I'm just so excited I think that's gonna be one of my resolutions this year is to like write at least every every week inside this journal because i don't want it to be another journal where it's just empty but i really do hope that y'all liked it please comment down below which one was your favorite layout and i'll see y'all in the next video bye thanks for watching